Hello my dear family members, I know many of you are eagerly waiting to see the latest questions of Cognizant. I don't know whether you are from cluster 1 or cluster 2 but for both SQL is common. And one thing to remember that is 30 aptitude questions are being asked and most of them are deductive type reasoning. I hope you will prepare accordingly. Today I will solve a coding questions which was asked on 4th June which are which is very important and can be repeated so let's see the question so the question is regarding ship rounds right so a ship needs to transport a certain number of people from point a to point b the capacity of the ship is denoted by an integer c and the total number of people to be transported is denoted by an integer n your task is to find and return the number of rounds that the ship needs to make in order to transport all the people from point a to point b right so the task is very simple so note that one round consists of ship traveling from point a to point b and then returning to point a okay so the task is very simple so before i read the input specification and output specification and before i show you the sample input output i would recommend you to have the prime materials of cognizant in which i have included live communication assessment technical questions coding questions previous and recent questions answers so to get that knock me at paste id instagram.com techno.ef please damn me i will try to assist you okay so here is the input specification that is input one an integer value c representing the capacity of the ship and the input two is an integer value n representing the total number of people to be transported and output specification is below that is a return an integer value representing the number of rounds that the ships needs to make okay so let's say the capacity of the uh, ship is 30 and there are 60 people right so how much round the ship need to make that is 2 right because it has a capacity of 30 people so only by 2 round this the ship can uh, shift all people from a to b right so let's see the sample input output so that it could be more easier okay so here is the sample input output so if the capacity of the ship is 50 and total number of people is 200 to be transported from uh, point a to point b then the output is 4 because total 50 people uh, 50 people can be carried by the ship at once right and it it, it will take total four times to uh, to transport all the people from point a to point b right so that's why that output is 4 right and in this case 30 is the capacity of the ship and 75 people need to be transported so 30 people at first then in the second round in the second ship the 30 people again so total 60 people are transported now 15 people are left with so for this 15 people the ship needs to uh the ship needs to make one round again right complete round that's why total three round needed to transport all 75 peoples from point a to point b that's why output is three so i hope you understood what the task is right so if you understood then please pause the video and try to solve the problem and give the answer in the comment section i hope i will give it and i will give you a heart okay and uh, let's see uh, let's solve the problem in python but what should be our logic what should be our syntax what should be our way to solve the problem so basically as you can see here just we have to divide the number of people by the capacity of the ship right that's mean that means uh, 200 by 50 that is 4 so this is a uh, very basic uh, common logic right but in this case as you can see 75 by 30 output should be 2 but here the output is 3 so what should be a uh, logic here so when the total number of people is not divided by the capacity of the ship then run a condition that is if this i mean this 75 mod 30 not equal to 0 then then round must be plus 1 right so make the round plus 1 so that it could be uh, valid logic okay so i hope you understood let's solve the problem i hope it will be more clear to you okay so at first let me define the functions def ship count okay sorry count and take the arguments like uh, capacity capacity and the number of people okay number of people and the at the first i have to divide the number of people by capacity right that is i will store that in round is equal to sorry round is actually a keywords that's why okay rounds is equal to number of 
purple by sorry by capacity okay sorry okay so now we have taken the floor value like uh, like, like 75 by 30 so i have taken the floor value that is 2 right okay now what should i do that is i have to run a if condition that is if the number of people number of people is not divided by capacity by capacity sorry not equal to zero then i have to increase the rounds by one okay so that the logic will be more appropriate okay just after the if block i will return sorry uh, sorry i'll run i return the rounds okay so let me call the function so print ship count and i will not take the user input i will just take uh, the values whatever given in the sample input output okay so capacity is let's say uh, 30 and the number of people is 75 okay so in this case output should be 3 and as you can see output is 3 and let's say uh, for the second sorry for the first uh, sample input output that is number of people is 400 sorry 200 and the capacity is 50 so output should be 4 and as expected right so here is no rocket science right very simple code but uh, it can i mean it seems like uh, harder questions but this is easy okay so i hope you understood what's the task what the logic i used here what that syntax i used here right so if you understood then please love this video and if you want this code then please join our telegram channel t.me slash ubk anna i will provide there and if you want more such content then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding any company that you want and if you want the prime materials of cognizant then please damn me at my insta id instagram.com slash techno.tf and don't worry about your money i will try to compensate it okay and please follow our instagram account instagram.com slash techno.tf i hope you will do it thank you for today's session